Hello, everybody. Everybody all right? Can everybody hear me? Give me a thumbs up, y'all, if everybody can hear me. Hello, everybody. Okay, now I can see here. Loud and clear. All right, all right. Got 184 people in the house. Y'all keep giving them thumbs up there. That's awesome. Those hearts and thumbs up is awesome. Y'all want to give me stars? That's awesome, too. That's one cent for each star, y'all. Hello, Teresa. Pittsburgh in the house. Plano is in the house. Got 200 people in the house. Wow. And I caught a lot of catfish today, but the catfish I'm actually using is Swahi today. It's my bootleg catfish, but it's the same thing. To me, it tastes better. But I'll explain that as I go along. I'm going to wait a couple of more minutes, y'all. I got about two minutes here, and then I'm going to get started here. I'm going to start making my hush puppy batter. And then we're going to make the catfish. We'll make the hush puppy. And then while the catfish is cooking, I'll make the tartar sauce. So, hope I can get all this done in an hour, which ain't no big deal. North Carolina in the house. Texarkana, Clarissa in the house. Altos, Oklahoma in the house. Louisville, Kentucky in the house. Welcome everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my bi-weekly live here. I did a live two weeks ago and I forgot what I did. I do YouTube lives and I do Facebook live and I do videos. So sometimes I forget what I did last time I did a live. My next live will be on, uh, let's see here. My next live will be the 8th, yeah, May the 8th, the day before Mother's Day. Okay, y'all, I'm going to get started here, and I'll read these uh, comments as I go here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to make some hush puppy batter here to go with the catfish. I'm going to make all this stuff freehand, y'all. I ain't going to measure nothing because I make it so many times. I'll let y'all know what I'm putting in it. Right now I'm just putting some regular cornmeal. Regular, regular yellow cornmeal. I always use yellow cornmeal, y'all. Make sure y'all can see this. Yeah, y'all can see it. Put a little sugar in there. Put a little sugar. I like my I like my hush puppy sweet, y'all. Put a little flour in here. Over there, a little bacon powder. And y'all know all corn, all uh, all hush puppy batter is is uh, thick cornbread. That's all it is, y'all. Put a little bacon powder in here. So right now, all I got in here, put a little salt. I'm going to get a little salt and put it in here. Put a little salt in there. Mix this up. I ain't going to make that many, y'all. Just make a, just give me about a dozen. So I'm going to get all that mixed up. Three or four more things I need to put in here. Now I got an egg I'm gonna put in here. I 
ain't going too fast. I'm gonna put some small, I like small, nice white onions. Just, I dice them up very small, y'all. White onions. You know that little grease I have sitting on the stove? Put a little grease in there. And that chicken grease, fish grease, put the little that in there. And put just enough milk in all the, to bring this together. enough milk, y'all, to bring it all together. I'm going to add a little bit more, uh, I'm going to add a little bit more, put a bit too much milk in here, y'all. I put a little bit too much milk, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to add a little bit more flour in here. Okay, everybody with me here? Let me read the comments. Oh, happy birthday, Sherry. Happy birthday, 55 years old. All right. Old school, all right. Cassandra. Hello, Cassandra. How you doing? Okay, y'all. Now. Okay, I got my husband up here. I'm going to sit it beside right here. Now, I'm going to make my... Uh, I'm gonna make my uh, tartar sauce right quick. Cause I like all this. Man, I like to let my hush puppy kind of rest a little. We're gonna make our tartar sauce here right quick, which is easier than uh, moving milk out the way. And it's just as easy as the hush puppy, y'all. Get all this out the way first. I think I'm gonna need a big spoon here. Make sure I didn't, did I, did I move y'all out of the way there? Okay, y'all can still see that. Flint, Michigan in the house. Okay, y'all, I'm gonna make a little tartar sauce. I, I, I use my, when I make tartar sauce, I use either Hellman's or Duke mayonnaise, y'all. I use Duke's or Hellman's. Get more in there. Okay. A little lemon juice in here. Just a little lemon juice, not much. That's just all you need right there. I'm gonna put a little salt and pepper, just a little. A little kosher salt and white pepper. Okay. Now, just a second here. Read y'all thing here. Now I got sweet relish. I use 
you just sweet pickle relish here. Put a little of that in there. I got some uh, small diced white onions. You know, if you don't like onions, you don't have to put it. And mix this up. Mix this up here. I never buy tartar sauce, y'all. It's so easy to make. So easy to make. I'm gonna put just a little bit more relish in there. I like a lot of relish in there. Put a little bit more. And that's it. Old school toilet sauce. So I got the toilet sauce made. I got my hush puppies uh, resting over there. See that? See with these onions? In fact, the rest of these onions, I'll just put them in, put them in the hush puppies here. It ain't going to hurt it. Okay, that's done. Oh, yeah, that's all the sauce. It is good. Okay. And I'll put a description of the other recipe y'all on the video uh say on description of the video recipes on the video description of the video at the bottom of the video with the recipe okay now let's rest these onions up in here Now we're gonna cook these hush puppies off. Okay, let me move y'all over here where y'all can see the fryer here. Oh yeah. Okay. I got my fryer here at 350. And all I do is scoop them in the fryer, y'all. And they'll come up to the top here in a second. Y'all, I think I need to put a little bit more, a little bit more, uh, a little bit more, let me get a fork here, I'm going to flip them over here. Let me get a pan here with a rack. You gotta, if I had them in the basket, I wouldn't have to kind of flip them, but I took my basket out where I can cook more of them at a time. There we 
go. And here we go, y'all. Going on, Kenneth? How you doing, sir? Thank you, sir. Take long to cook, y'all. They don't take long at all. Come over here and let them drain. This thing is so good, y'all. Okay. I don't have catfish today. I got the next best thing while I can. I got Swahi here. So what I'm going to do, let me get a bowl here. I'm going to make a little egg wash for my catfish. Y'all probably can't see what I'm doing here. Yeah, okay, there we go. There we go. Oh, you made the sugar cream pies. All right. Y'all go watch my video I uploaded last night or this morning. I made them last night. The sugar cream pie. I'll show y'all one here in a minute. Okay. Put my catfish in here. Like I said, not really catfish or swahi. Let me move this over now. This is what I use for my breading. That's why I'm not going to season this catfish because this is seasoned already. I love this stuff. The only thing I do to it, I add flour to this. I take a little down the fish fry. Put a little in there. And I'm going to add flour to it. It, to me, it, it stabilizes it. It kind of stabilizes it a little. To me, I don't like the texture of it, so I add a little flour to mine. I don't, I don't stop that. It's like it's too meaty for me. So I add a little flour in here. And all I'm going to do, my fish here. in the fryer. More. One more in here. I'll do three at a time here, y'all. Just not the over. Oh wow, 
thank you, Bunny. Hey, my collard greens, ham hog, corn bread for dinner. All right. Oh, you made the butter stock and top the pie. Awesome. Awesome. Now, this one I like to do. While my, corn, while my catfish is cooking, bring my hot pot up. So light. One thing about frying this fish, when it float, it's ready. So it's very simple, y'all. It's not rocket science when it come to fish. Hold on, David. David in the house. Fresh fish. <laughs> It's definitely ready here. And it don't take long on fish, of course. Y'all know if you ever cook fish, it don't take long at all. Somebody sent me some stars and I didn't see it. Fried fish, hot sauce, light bread, all that. You old school, bros. She's, a lot of people don't know what light bread is.
Y'all excuse my meat needs hush puppy. They so light and crispy. Kind of move it around y'all to make sure it don't stick to the bottom. And I'm not using my basket. I'm going to use my spider here. Good old school Saturday night cooking, y'all. Don't get no better than that. All right. Like I said, y'all see that fish when it looks like this? Come on out of here. It's, it's ready to come out. It's had enough. Kind of wear a wire rack or something to put your fish stuff on. Use the wire rack because if you use a paper towel, it is just absorbed in the grease and make it. It's gonna make your fish soggy. Got this one here. One more, y'all. Hey, I'm cooking on 350. Y'all know that's my. I love that cooking. Here. I cook everything on 350 most of the time. That way it's not too hot and not too low. I got you. One more here. Alright, y'all, I'm gonna turn my fire off. Now I'm gonna make my plate here look all fancy and stuff for the picture of this, y'all. Give me one second. Take a little picture of this. I gotta take a picture and then we're gonna try this out. temperature I think it has. I'm going to cook some more of these uh, hush puppies. All right. 
Exactly, ASM. That's perfect. Now you're right. I use my deep fry in front of my, on top of my stove. Exactly. Exactly. Okay, let me chat with y'all a little bit here. That whole thing took 30 minutes, y'all. 30 minutes, I'm finished, ready to eat. See how quick it is to make a to make a meal for your family in less than an hour. I got a full meal here, pretty much. Pretty much. Pretty much. something I don't normally do. I'm going to put them right on the There's no better than that. Mm. There's no better than that, y'all. Look at that. Hot puppy. How tender it is. This stuff, this hot puppy is so light, y'all. So light. I don't like a heavy hot puppy. I like them to be nice and light. Hello, Miss Frankie. You are live, Miss Frankie. You didn't miss the video. How you doing tonight? 
Thank everybody for the hearts. No, I didn't make no slow. No, okay, y'all got that. I'm going back to the comments that I missed. Check in the house. Yeah, Miss Beverly. You caught me live. Like I can say I'm gonna hang out with y'all about 20 minutes here. I always try to do an hour lives. At least an hour, you know, when I'm on live. And I got cook I got through cooking so quick. Uh See how the breading stays on it? Dip it in there. That's another key. Remember had fish? The breading just come on. Mm -mm. Do this method here. A little hush puppy with it. Hmm. Awesome. Hey, white clip. I'm gonna put the recipe. It'll probably be tomorrow. I'm gonna put the recipe in the down in the script in the video. Just just an old school Saturday night dish, y'all. It don't take long to make. Man, I ain't killed my neighbor tonight. To be honest, I can eat all this fish right here tonight by myself. I love fish, especially fresh fish. I can eat all this by myself. And the hush puppies, what I do, I'll take them when they cool down. I put them in the bag and I freeze them. And when I need hush puppies, I just pull them out. That's why I made so many hush puppies. After you finish the show, all you gotta do is I'm gonna leave this video up, y'all. And when I log off tonight, I'm gonna leave it up. Y'all go back and watch this live again. It'll always be up. I'm not gonna delete it. Thank you, Gio. Miss Beverly is in the house. I'll make sure everybody gives a thumbs up and a heart before y'all leave out the room. All right, now I'm back, y'all. Somehow I got disconnected. Can y'all hear me? <laughs> Somehow my stream kept froze up. I don't know. But I'm back now. Anybody got any questions, comments, or concerns before I log off here?
Okay, now you can hear me. Okay. Thank you, Marie. Appreciate that. I appreciate everybody supporting, watching my videos and posts and, and uh, whether it's YouTube or Facebook or Instagram or I do not like crawfish. Look, catfish, really cat swahi, but it's catfish and hush puppies. I just used uh go back Frankie and watch the rest of uh, watch the video, but this is what I use. This is what I use on my fish. I use Louisiana fish fries, the crispy one, and I add flour to it. So I do two parts of this, one part flour. And that what makes the, the makes it look like that. That's what I use. I'm here. Can y'all hear me? I'm here, Kathy. The hush puppy done. I'm going to put in the... Uh I'm going to put in the script of the video. If I missed anybody, uh, questions. Is anybody questions here? You can't hear me, Kathy? It must be your connection. Because I'm right up on the microphone. <laughs> Okay, y'all, I'm about to log off here, but I'm going to leave this video live up and uh, so y'all can go back and watch and see what I did. And maybe y'all can, you know, do the same thing. And tomorrow, it'll probably be tomorrow, I'll put up the recipe of everything I cook in the description of this live so y'all can go back. And, and I'm also going to move this over, probably be tomorrow morning, I'm going to move this over to uh, YouTube channel. So you can go watch it on YouTube also. <laughs> so, yeah. But anyway, uh, Janisa, I, I'm in Katy, Texas, but I don't have a restaurant. I just cook for fun out of my house. That's what I do on the, on the for my hobby. It's just a hobby. Well, y'all, I'm going to log off here. 
And I appreciate everybody coming tonight and watching my little my little uh, cooking expedition here. And I'll be back this Saturday before Mother's Day. And I don't know what I'm going to cook. Uh, but it'll be something probably creative. But go watch my other videos I put up uh, this morning. I did a, a matter of fact, hold on just a second. I don't know if y'all saw the video on my uh, sugar cream pie, but go watch the video. I don't know if I put it on Facebook or not, but it's on YouTube channel. This an old school pie, way back in the day pie. A lot of people never heard of it. Uh, but go watch the video on that. It's on YouTube channel, and maybe I'll upload it on the Facebook. I do that. Uh, uh, I'll do that on Facebook probably later this week. So anyway, y'all, thanks you. And I don't know why my internet is freezing up and stuff like that. I don't understand this. Technology, you know how that is. But anyway, I'm going to log off now. And like, make sure y'all follow my other social media. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch TV, Pinterest, and OldSchoolSoulFood.com. Until next time, have a blessed Old School Soul Food day. And I'll see y'all later on in two, in two weeks in my next live. Appreciate everybody coming by. I love y'all. Thanks for everybody's support. I will see y'all soon. Bye.